Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sean Assault, and I'd like to welcome to my Minecraft programming series. In this video, we're going to be starting with arrays. So, an array is basically a whole bunch of variables in in one of it in one variable. Basically, a set of variables. So, for instance, let's add a button. Button. Yeah. But why is this being highlighted? In a way? Okay, what's wrong? Oh, I have a hyphen thing there for some reason. For some reason. Oh, it's midnight. I have school again tomorrow. And what? Add a variable? So for instance, we can have a variable. We can have variable A Q W E F R T. All of these variables we can have, for instance, right? And it will be of type uh, string. So we can do this like it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 variables. So we can have this. Né? Or we could just have a simple called array strings. We can just have this and we have an array one, two, so that was all 18 stuff of string. So basically, this is much better the array than using all of this. So, how we, so we would have said like um, a equals that and then like q w e r g. So, we would have set this for instance ne? then all the other then all the others also but with an array it's much easier we can just basically say the first one would be that uh, let us copy and paste this First one is this, second one. This is a much easier way to do this. So we then basically it works the same. Like um, we can show message the fifth one. Oh, I mean T. And here we can just show message array string the Six one we'll do exactly this. This will do exactly the same. So as you guys can see, it's basically just how arrays work. Um, uh, you can get the length of an array by saying using a simple link function. Link array string. Then we basically get the amount of things in it. Let's just convert this to a string. To string, okay. So, yep. 18 items in the um, array, which is 80. Or we can then, for instance, just ask the length of the. Uh, uh, the third one, which is that one, this one, here, yeah. okay. So, the length of it is seven characters long. Basically, it works, it works, it works, it works basically exactly the same as, as a normal variable, just has some benefits. That's basically what an array is. Um, there's also a 2D array and a 3D array, and I think you can even go to um, a nine-dimensional nine array. I will talk about that later in the videos. Um, we'll be talking about. I will make an, an, another video soon, uh, probably right after, right after this video in a few minutes, where I explain. Let's explain this now. This not, I'll explain this in, in, in a different video. Uh, two D arrays, which basically this is basically one D array. Like um, all of the data is like 
believe each believe each other like so let me do something else let's use excel so basically we currently have an array that looks like uh, this and it has 18 values in it so our array looks like this then we get a 2d array which basically looks like this so basically that's how our, our, our array will look if you have a 2d array and every we want it so we'll talk more about that in future videos and uh, this is video I think the 40th video yes the 40th video guys we have 40 videos guys not 40 videos but 40th topic kind of in the series so we have, we have a lot of videos so far I'm hoping to have more than a hundred videos by the end of the series so maybe, so maybe talk about this studio race in video 40.1 so thanks for watching guys make sure to like comment subscribe and share i'll see you in the next